Fuck, fuck the reeds. You know, sometimes I was reading this thing about this couple that mountain climbs, and they were trying to climb one of the more difficult ones where you're literally walking in the jet stream. It was wind was blowing so bad they couldn't sleep at night. So, of course, one of these fucking morons gets lifted up in the air by the wind, slammed down between two rocks. Her foot gets stuck in between the rocks, and then the wind is blowing so hard, it twists her body around, and she breaks her fucking leg. Now the other two fucking jerk-offs, who were also completely safe before they decided out of, out of the fucking blue, out of nowhere, to put their lives at risk, right? With absolutely no respect for anybody else in the world who gets tortured, who lives in these horrible fucking war-torn conditions, you know what I mean? And all they want to do is just be able to come home and be safe. These two fucking free morons decide that they're going to go up there and deliberately put their lives at risk. So now the other two assholes have to carry this lady down with her spiral fracture, taking turns while walking into the jet stream. And I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing during this when I'm reading this. Am I supposed to be thinking, wow, what incredible human beings? I don't. I just think what a couple of fucking morons. Because then some poor bastard has to fly a helicopter up there and try and meet him and risk his fucking life. So I, I just, I don't know. I don't know how people in the Coast Guard do it. I don't know how these people in, like, helicopters around the fucking world, their job, what, what is your job, sir? What is your job, man? We all, what is my job? Oh, I rescue fucking morons. <laughs> You know, I mean, the fire department has that to a, to a, a certain extent. You know, somebody's sitting there smoking a cigarette, eating a Pop-Tart in bed, nodding off, and he lights his fucking bed on fire, right? Then they got to go in there and go get the guys. He's hiding in the closet, you know, with the frosting still around his lips that's starting to melt. They have to go in there. And they got to go get the guy. I don't You want to talk about fucking hero? How do, how do they do that? You have to go risk your life to save a fucking moron. Is they're making the call? Yeah, hey, wh- hey, my my wife broke her leg. Uh, I got. Oh yeah, where are you? Where's your house? Oh nah, we climbed up a mountain. The fuck did you do that for? Oh god, I would love to take those calls. What the fuck did you do that for? Great. Great. So now, now, let me guess. Now you want us to go up there and go get you, you fucking moron? <laughs> you know we should leave you up there, right? You, you know you deserve that, right? Do you understand the person flying up there in the helicopter is, in a, is expecting it? To, he's becoming a father in another month, and he might not make it because you fucking idiots left a perfectly good hotel room and decided to c- climb up there, so what? You could talk loudly about it in a bar with your frostbitten cheeks, you dumb cunts. Tell you what, walk another thousand feet down the fucking mountain. I'll check the forecast. Maybe I'll pick you up in a week. <laughs> I guess you got to be cut out for that job. I don't know. You know, if I was a gun nut, I'd, I'd join the fucking military. That, that, that's what you want to do, right? You know, you know what the deal is. You start off with tin cans, then you move up to squirrels, then you shoot a bird, right? And then eventually you're getting fucking bored because at the end of the day, no matter how difficult it is, no matter how much deer urine you got to put on yourself, you're shooting something dumber than you. At some point, you want to go after the ultimate prey, okay? You've watched Jurassic Park too many times. You realize there's no real... Velociraptors, whatever the fuck they, they goddamn things were, you realize there aren't enough of those. You're like, I'm joining the goddamn military, right? That's what you do. I wonder how many psychos did that, you know? They always say that they're doing it for your freedom, right? I, I joined, I saw something happen, and I was like, I'm not, yeah, and then there are those people. Come on, somebody, write me an anonymous. What branch of the service are you in? Huh? Are you in the Coast Guard? You ever get the sense one of the people you're working with joined just because they wanted to see someone half eaten by a shark? Pull them out of the water just to see what it looks like, you know? I think the Coast Guard, that's, that's like the worst fucking, like, out of all the jobs. Because the war never ends. 
It never ends. You know, hopefully at some point this shit will end over in the Middle East. You know, um, I don't know how it ends, but who the fuck knows? But anyways, um, the Coast Guard, it never fucking ends. That right there. I mean, can you get the Medal of Honor? They should have a civilian saving a dumb civilian Medal of Honor for the fucking Coast Guard. Do you realize every time there's like a bad storm coming and they're telling everybody to stay inside and you're like, oh, okay, you get excited, you know, because, oh, they sent me home from work early. Oh, we get to light a fire in the fireplace, you know. Let's watch Raising Arizona. Get the kids together. and will all wrap up in a blanket and you have a great fucking time. I'll make some s'mores. That's why I love you, lady. Right? You're getting ready. You know what the fuck they're doing in the Coast Guard? Their fucking palms are sweating. Their stomach is in a knot because they know some stupid fuck is going to get in his goddamn boat or on his fucking surfboard or his boogie board or some dumb shit. He's going to go on a fucking hike. All right? And he's going to all of a sudden, you got to come get me. And these people who are completely safe got to get in their fucking, got to get in a fucking helicopter fly out in the middle of a fucking hurricane to find some fucking dope in his silly named yacht who had to take the fucking thing out, right? Had to show off in front of his trophy fucking wife, and now they got to go out there. And some poor bastard has got to fucking jump out of a helicopter in a hurricane into the fucking ocean to try to get these fucking dopes out of there, back to the land, so what? They can breed and make more stupid people. So the people at the top of the Coast Guard can keep making their fucking blood money. We're taking callers. That right there is the scariest fucking job. I am terrified of the fucking ocean. Okay? You would not want to have a bunch of me's in the Coast Guard. Okay? Those fucking boats would just be sitting there in the sun and on the... That would be it. That would be it. I would fucking... I would be... We would be on the dock. I'd be on the boat with a life jacket on playing cards... And I would get, like, this distress call. Hey, they said, we're out in the ocean. I don't know if we're going to make it. I'd be like, hey, ro- roger that. Uh, well, what the fuck are you doing out there? I mean, what the fuck are you going out there for? Is it the fucking hurricane? Jesus Christ, you want the fucking news? Over. There's a fucking shark coming at me. I don't give a fuck. So what the fuck is this? I don't give a fuck. That would be me. I would have that meltdown every time, and then I would do the job. Because basically, at the end of the day, if I was in the Coast Guard, that's how I have to fucking make my living. And now I have to go out there and fish some fucking dope out there. Is anybody in the Coast Guard listening to this? Can you please tell me? There's no way when you fish somebody out of the ocean, okay, and then they... And you gotta fucking go last. And then they send that fucking hook down again, right? It's just sitting there in 40-foot waves. Like, whoa, whoa, fucking going up and down. When they, when they fucking crank you back up into that goddamn helicopter, there is no fucking way you don't talk some shit to that guy. Is he sitting there with that fucking... <laughs> I almost got swallowed by the ocean look on his face. Whatever the fuck that looks like. He knows he's fucking dumb, right? You must look him right in the head. Hey, fuckhead. Next time you take your boat out, why don't you make sure the fucking sun's out and it's not a fucking whatever... What, how do they rate a hurricane? Fucking got goddamn five hurricane. It's unbelievable. You know what I always think that they fucking look like? I mean, you just, I would be so fucking embarrassed if I ever did some dumb shit like that and somebody had to go out and risk their fucking life, fly a fucking helicopter. You're not supposed to fly in turbulence with helicopters as far as my, my little knowledge of it. And these fucking guys got to go fly out into that shit. Unfucking believable. You know, they ever make a movie about the Coast Guard? Huh? Well, I didn't see it. Um, fucking made a movie about, dol- made a whole TV show about a fucking dolphin saving people. They call him Flipper Flip. He can breathe. He can hold his breath and then he comes up and he's supposed to be there. All right? They ever make a fucking TV show about a, 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 a guy saving fish? You know, that beach themselves and you throw it back? Maybe they did. Was it Free Willy? Well, actually, we captured that one. 
I don't know. If, I, if the Coast Guard ever fishes me out of the fucking ocean, you know what the look I'm going to have on my face? Do you remember when OJ got arrested the second time and he knew he was fucked, but he was trying to smile? Remember that fucking, that's the fucking look I would have on my face. I'd just be like, I know, I know. You don't have to say it. It's that they, they, you shouldn't say a fucking word to those people after you pull them out of the water. Even the gold digging whore. You know? Just talk to her. Have you had enough? Have you had enough rich old cock at this point, sweetheart? Why don't you go back, finish up at community college, and build a real fucking life? Okay? No, we didn't find your other glass high heel, you fucking stripper. You know, and then you take them back to the base. Um, anyway, sorry. Most of that was just the stress of my day. The Coast Guard. What's their fight song? If you're fucking dumb enough to go out in the ocean during a hurricane, it's our fucking job to go get you, even though we want you to drown. Uh